Operation Nightmare. A statewide execution of search warrants happened simultaneously this morning as officials closed in on the suspects believed to be responsible for the grisly massacre of six people, mostly family members, in Goshen last month. Good afternoon, I'm Elena Rusk. This morning, the Tulare County Sheriff announced the two main suspects in this case have been arrested and our 17 news cameras were there. Today, Sheriff Mike Boudreau sharing surveillance video from that night when the family was murdered in what the sheriff called a cartel-style attack and execution. The sheriff confirmed several of the victims were shot in the head, at least one while she was sleeping, another while she was kneeling. You can see here the youngest victims, 16-year-old Alyssa Perez running to save her 10-month-old baby, Nicholas Perez. The sheriff says Alyssa and Nicholas were later found dead in the street, both shot in the back of the head. Today, the sheriff confirmed two of the victims were confirmed members of the Sereños gang, living in an area predominantly controlled by the rivaling Norteños gang. We are now learning investigators have been narrowed in on the two Norteños suspects since January 23rd, with constant 24-7 surveillance on them because of DNA evidence left behind at the scene. Those suspects identified as Noah Beard of Visalia and Angel Uriarte of Goshen. In Operation Nightmare Today, three search warrants were executed at 6 a.m. at homes in and around Goshen and Visalia, and 17 News, as you can see, was there. You can see suspect Beard taken out into custody without incident at a home on Noise Street in Visalia. The sheriff says the other main suspect identified as Angel Uriarte fired at officers and was hit by an ATF agent at another home in Goshen. He was taken into custody and rushed to the hospital for surgery, where the ATF says he is in stable condition and is expected to survive. My message to Governor Newsom. Governor, we've arrested the perpetrators. We've done our part. We're asking that you do your part. We need to look at death sentence justice for those who kill the innocents of the innocent. For anyone who looked at this video and saw that petite teenage mother run to save her 10-month-old infant by placing it over the fence and jumping a fence as illegal criminals who aren't supposed to have guns have guns. These are not innocent law-abiding people. Took the life of a 10-month-old child. I'm asking that the governor revisit I'm asking that someone here in the media take this video to the governor so he can look at it and ask the question, is this justice for Californians? Now, also during Operation Nightmare today, more than 8,000 inmates affiliated with the Nuestra Familia gang were searched at multiple prisons statewide, including Corcoran and North Kern State Prisons. Read much more about this case on our website, kgt.com, and of course, we'll have full coverage tonight at 5.